David, what do you believe in? Do you believe in God? Um, the God concept, I know, is very complicated. Yeah, well, the complicated. God, God concept is quite an interesting one because the minute you say that you believe in God, um, that gives someone else some kind of uh, right to tell you <laughs> what to do. Um, uh, my philosophical approach to this issue really um, is one as, as a modal realist, um, as a pluralist and as a, a person who, who um, you could say I'm a possibilian. I believe that there's an infinite um, possibility of an infinite amount of universes and sure, one, one of those universes, I've got no doubt that there is a God that exists in that universe. The uh, question really is, does God exist in every universe? And is God necessary for the existence of the universe that one is living in now? Um, I think I'd uh, rather leave that up to science. Yeah. That, um, there's, there's no real scientific evidence to show that, that there is a God active in the universe that we're living in. So uh, you could say I'm a non-theist. Um, you could say I'm a non-theist, theist, or a realist. Uh, but fundamentally, I'm a pluralist. I, I believe that all pos all possible worlds are equally valid. That all truths are equally true. That um, there's no one particular reality or religion that has a monopoly on the truth. Mm. So it's, for me, it's, it's a very loaded term. Um, I might have um, a sense of connection with a higher power and that there's a su super luminal being out there. But for me, politically speaking, the minute one um, gives a name to that force and says uh, whether it's Hashem or uh, Allah or Jesus Christ, um, it sets up a, a bureaucracy on earth where people lawyers uh, start telling you what it is that you're supposed to believe in. So um, the problem of theocracy, the problem of South Africa being, well, having been a theocracy essentially where the church and the state were one and the same. Now in the new South Africa we, we've got this constitution supposedly recognizing differences and divergences of opinion and yet the church taking up this role where People, the majority of people in this country believe in Jesus, um, believe in the church, think that they've got rights to d determine what minorities such as myself think or feel, how we, how we act or believe, you know, what um, my experience of reality might be very different from another person's experience of reality. It doesn't mean that that reality is any less valid or any less true. So um, if you want to continue this discussion about 